It's October 2021. This is after COVID, but before the rediscovery of outside. I was scrolling through Anka and Squid Game memes when I came across this. At the time, I was just finishing my first Chrome extension yeah, you see me available on the Chrome website. and was thinking about ideas for other Chrome extensions when an idea began to sprout in my head. Remember the nostalgia of browsing the internet in the early 2000s? Remember searching for Russian Lego sets and Flash games from the third page of Google, where flashy pop-ups and scam ads ruled? What if somebody made a Chrome extension that brought these relics to the modern internet experience? Three years passed as I sat on this idea, until I recently decided to work on it with a couple friends. There wasn't too much to it. I started by figuring out the styling for an old Windows pop-up look, which came together pretty quick. Now, three years after first seeing him, I finally had fish on my browser. I downloaded some copyright-free pop-up sounds, and used text-to-speech for some warning messages, warning, oh no, era, and made the extension randomly choose which sound to play upon creating a pop-up. I put the pop-ups on a random timer, I put the pop-ups on a random timer, and then everything was looking pretty good. Warning. I set it up so that it was easy to add pop-ups, but unfortunately, they quickly devolved into serious brain rot. We ended up adding a pop-up with random text and buttons. Warning. A pop-up which forces users to choose between two colors to change all text to. I really like this one. A pop-up which deletes the page. A pop-up which can't be deleted and spawns an army if you try. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No 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 no. Oh no no no. A pop-up that spawns a piranha which eats your cursor. And whatever this is. I decided to call the extension Ad Blocker Blocker, which is not a very marketable name, but I think it's funny, and I don't expect the extension to be very marketable anyways. More pop-ups could easily be added, but this was a serious headache to work on. The flashiness and dumb jokes were just too much. If I have any ideas for some other actually funny pop-ups, I may decide to add them in the future. The extension is available on the Chrome Web Store. Please don't download it.